we want to find the antiderivative and put it in its general form for f of x equals 5. So to do that, we're going to use the integral of x raised to the r dx, which is equal to x raised to the r plus 1 over r plus 1 plus c. So what we end up getting is the integral of 5 dx, which is going to be equal to well, in this case, we have um, 5 raised to the 0 plus 1. Well, it's not 0 plus 1, but um, r, in, well, r in this case is 0. So, well, okay, 0 plus 1. <laughs> and then 0 plus 1 plus c. So what we end up with is just, uh, um, oh, and sorry, this is x. Yeah, zero, uh, x raised to the 0 plus 1. That does make sense. I got confused there. So it ends up being just 5x plus c. And that's it. All right. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching.